Folks, you know, I uh, don't like to talk about myself that much, but <laughs> longtime viewers of last night's show know that yesterday I talked about hot dogs, a subject near and dear to my heart because they're lodged in my arteries. <laughs> and as I mentioned last night, a shocking investigation has found that after testing 75 brands of hot dogs, 2% of them contained human DNA. <laughs> That's right. Some of those hot dogs are actually hot dogs. <laughs> now. Still sound pretty good, though. Still sound pretty good. Now, the report doesn't specify the source of the human DNA. Is it hair? Is it fingernails? Did a lonely factory worker stay late one night and seduce a sausage casing machine? <laughs> Could your pig in the blanket have a bun in the oven? Who knows? <laughs> Folks. <laughs> You're welcome for that image, by the way. Folks, this news completely changes America's love affair with the all beef Frank, or should I say, the all Frank beef. <laughs> and the sad meat news just keeps on coming because today I heard something that was a grade A bummer. Bad news for bacon lovers and lovers of a lot of things. The World Health Organization has ruled that bacon, sausage, and other processed meats can cause cancer. It put processed meat in the same danger category as cigarettes and asbestos. What? <laughs> Smoked meats are as dangerous as asbestos? Well, there goes my plan to insulate my attic with jerky. <laughs> How can cured meat be bad for you? It's got the word cure right in the name. Next, you're going to tell me that lifesavers don't help drowning people. <laughs> Makes no sense. This is sad. So sad. I live for meat. I have, and this is true, I have a two-pound slab of bacon in my fridge at all times. I've got to. I'm the father of two teenage boys. <laughs> the only way I can get them out of bed in the morning is to fry up some bacon. That's what the kids call waken and bacon. <laughs> that smell. You get that stuff sizzling in the pan, it makes them float down to the kitchen like a cartoon hobo following the smell waves from a pie. You think they're gonna come running downstairs to the scent of me washing kale? <laughs> Kids, it's time for breakfast. Come watch Daddy cry into his cantaloupe. <laughs> but now, according to doctors, I can't smoke and I can't eat bacon, but they haven't said anything about smoking bacon. Here we go. That is actually better than I imagined. <laughs> but be careful, the pork these days is so much stronger than it was in the 60s. <laughs> but the thing that really gets my goat, if I can even have goat anymore, <laughs> is the way vegetarians reacted to this news. Because using the hashtag smug vegetarian, which is redundant, by the way. They got all veggier than thou on Twitter, saying things like, ha, huh, I'm always right, now I have proof, see ya, bacon eaters, and mwahahaha, red meat causes cancer, like we didn't know that already, sorry, meat eaters, oh, ha, ha, ha. Here's a vegetarian joke, why did the chicken cross the road? I hope you get cancer. I get it, vegetarians. When you see your fellow human being suffering, it's funny. But heaven forbid I should eat a shrimp. <laughs> you are aware that an ear of corn has a better chance at forming a coherent thought than a shrimp, right? <laughs> Have you ever had a conversation with a shrimp? It's almost as boring as talking to a vegetarian. <laughs> and I hope... I hope you're comfortable on that high horse you refuse to eat veggies. Because <laughs> you got me. Slap on the cuffs, Officer Tofu. Eating meat is bad for you. Of course, 
I don't engage in that kind of petty schadenfreude. <laughs> so it brings me absolutely no pleasure to tell you that the same hot dog study I mentioned earlier also found that 10% of vegetarian hot dogs contain meat. <laughs> That's right. That's right. You know that time you thought you tasted something flavorful? That was the meat. All right, keep in mind, right? Right? Am I right? And keep in mind, not just any meat, because in two thirds of all vegetarian hot dogs, they also found human DNA. <laughs> two thirds! Tofu dogs are people! They're people! So, vegetarians, stick that in your pipe and smoke it. <laughs>